The gentleman from California is recognized. Mr. Speaker, I rise today to enter the following words into the congressional record. No union is more profound than marriage, for it embodies the highest ideals of love, fidelity, devotion, sacrifice, and family. In forming a marital union, two people become something greater than once they were. As some of the petitioners, petitioners in these cases demonstrate, marriage embodies a love that may endure even past death. It would misunderstand these men and women to say they disrespect the idea of marriage. Their plea is that they do respect it, respect it so deeply that they seek to find its fulfillment for themselves. Their hope is not to be condemned to live in loneliness, excluded from one of civilization's oldest institutions. They ask for equal dignity in the eyes of the law. The Constitution grants them that right. The judgment of the Court of Appeals for the Sixth Circuit is reversed. It is so ordered. These words, Mr. Speaker, were written by Supreme Court Justice Anthony Kennedy in his Obergefell versus Hodges ruling, and they embody what the LGBT community has pursued for decades, equality under the law. Thank you, and I yield back the balance of my time. Gentleman yields back his time.